Hello dear students, today I will going to give you a complete history of music. I am Professor Big L and this is on video because uh, Internet Explorer just told me that there's some kind of uh, virus going around and we need to uh, give all lessons uh, online, so I thought I'd make this recording. Uh, somehow there's uh, something like Corolla 19 or something, I don't know, it's 20, 24, so I don't know what the 19 is doing there, but alright, let's get started. So in the dark times, there was no music, but then there was the first sound ever made, it was Gregorian chant. They also invented notation, but they were scared of course, so it did not sound very good. Then there was Bach. Bach invented music. The 565 is still the best piece ever, I don't know what the lobster is doing there in the corner. And uh, Bach invented uh, everything from chords, voice leading, culture, the concept of rhythm entirely. Bach was the big goat, no one can be better than him. And then we get to Mozart, he was a great Bach wannabe. Um, it was noteworthy that he already uh, re uh, wrote the uh, 565 uh, from memory at the age of minus two. He wasn't born yet and he already uh, was making some really uh, um, Bach-like music. Then there was Beethoven, he is also a Bach wannabe and he invented the orchestra because he wanted to make more sounds and music. And then there was Wagner. He invented film music, for which he, we hate him still to this day, because film music sucks. Film music is not real music. And he was also a Bach wannabe, of course. Then there was Schoenberg. He actually invented music too, a tonal boogaloo. He was just a little bit of a Bach wannabe, but uh, he made some big contributions to music, actually. And then there was also Bartok. He was like a Bach wannabe, but cooler than most, and he also sounded a little bit like Schoenberg, but not really. And then there were also some other kinds of noise um, that are not really music, but we already discussed all, all of music, so we need to fill the rest of this lesson. Let's start with jazz. Jazz is only for nerds. It's just a jumble of notes. It's very, very yucky. It's a saxophone. Yippee. And then there's rock and pop. It's just filthy noise. Ew, we hate rock and pop. It sucks. It's not real music. Oh, hey, there's an exception. There's also Metallica. They invented metal music and they use some elements of music. You know what that means? They are all Bach wannabes. Thank you for coming to this lesson and thank you for taking this course. The exam will be uh, next week. Goodbye.